Okay, guys, next from the turtle position. Occasionally you can catch a guy with a very simple schoolboy choke. Maybe you can throw this knee in, you got the arm wrapped around, you're watching the Granby roll, and you're pounding the heck out of him. Okay, sometimes he's going to base up or look for that stand up or that sit out, and he's going to bring this head up. You know, if he's defending well here, but you're hitting him this way, maybe you're under punching him under the armpit, this way he might look up. If the guy looks up at all, reach this around, take it off the waist control, slide that in, and then scissor your hips out and lean back. Very simple choke. Once I arch here, and put the weight back. It's nasty, like a reverse guillotine with the, the blade of the forearm on the throat. So in here, you're hitting him, you're trying to throw hooks in, whatever. If this guy bases up or he starts to set up a, a, a stand-up sometimes, he looks up to explode up to the sky like a wrestler, you can slip this in and sit your weight out and arch your hips and you're back on top of him. Here's where your weight goes, okay? Meanwhile, I have his arm and you're pulling up. So try the schoolboy choke, put that in your repertoire because you never know when someone's going to open up, open up. People are getting better and better rear naked choke defense. You need other attacks in your repertoire, especially from the turtle. Guys really don't know what to do and even punches and elbows aren't enough because they're hitting the back of the head and wrestle warning guys. Put other submission moves in your repertoire.